Hello, my name is Jorge Imus, and today let's talk about the Boxer Rebellion. The Boxer Rebellion took place in modern day China from November 2nd, 1899 to September 7th, 1901. The reason why the rebellion took place was due to an increase of anti Christian, anti foreign, and anti imperial sentiment. These anti sentiments led to the formation of the Righteousness and Harmonious Fist also known as Yi Huang. The West called them by another name. They called them boxers, in large part of them being athletic and practice of a martial arts. At first, the Qing government did not officially support the boxer rebels, but after much debate in the Qing imperial court, Empress Dowager Cixi, along with a majority of conservatives, decided to issue an edict to not only support the boxers, but as also expel foreigners and to declare war on them. As a result, the Imperial Army and the Boxers began to besiege the Beijing Litigation Quarter, just south of the Forbidden City. The Litigation Quarter comprised of diplomats and soldiers mostly from the Western world such as the UK, France, Austria-Hungary, and the United States to name a few. Almost 4,000 people from foreign civilians to Chinese Christians were under siege for less than a month. Fortunately, prior to the siege of the Legation in Beijing, several European diplomats inside the Legation decided to send help due to the ever-growing anti-foreign sentiment. However, unfortunately for them, only around 55,000 men began to arrive off the coast of Tianjin. The army was comprised of troops from Japan, UK, France, Russia, Germany, Austria, Hungary, and the United States. After the Empress declaration of war on foreign powers, several regional governors, mostly from Southeast China, decided not to answer the call to war. As a result, they formed the Mutual Protection of Southeast China, a neutral defense pact designed to be neutral during the Boxer Rebellion. At first, the Imperial Army and the Boxers began winning a few skirmishes of what they seemed to perceive as invaders. But after a while, the Eight Nation Alliance began to push them back and headed towards Beijing. While this is happening, the Russians began capturing Manchuria. After the Empress began to retreat from Beijing, the Alliance occupied several key cities and the capital itself. But of course, no war is without atrocities. The Alliance has committed several key atrocities from raping to pillaging and plundering. All of this in the name of saving diplomats, several Christians, and a few soldiers who were occupied in the litigation quarter of the capital. Seeing how this is, was a defeat yet again by foreign powers, the Empress decided to sign unfair peace treaties from war reparations to seceding lands from Japan. And notice how the Qing Dynasty lost the Boxer Rebellion. <laughs> 